from matchy matchy attire to boring snoring designs. Here are this week's worst dressed celebrities. I'm Kirby Kristen, and you're watching Fashion Offenders. Zasha Mamet stepped out in a bright red leather dress at the girls' season four premiere in New York. This is the first time I've endorsed something the HBO star has worn. This Alexander McQueen frock is fun and flirty. However, there is a but. I absolutely hate the matching satin shoes. And from the look on her face, she too is confused why her stylist chose the clunky coordinating platforms to complete her otherwise fabulous ensemble. So close, Zasha. Also in the Big Apple, Julianne Moore donned a Dolce & Gabbana number for the National Board of Review Awards. The part lace, part carnation design is confusing, and I am definitely not confused on my opinions of carnations. They're a waste of space in a vase and on a frock. That's my review and I'm sticking to it. Sorry, Julianne. Moving along to the West Coast now, Anne Hathaway may have looked like she was at a meditation retreat in this all-white getup, but instead she was actually in attendance at the Palm Springs International Film Festival. The only thing saving the actors from her tranquil and boring wardrobe is her bold berry lip. Keep calm and change your outfit, Anne. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next week. Make sure to come back next Friday for a new episode of Fashion Offenders. And be sure to like this video and subscribe to Wonderwall. Also, let us know what you think of Zasha, Julianne, and Anne's style in the comments. We'll see you next week, but if you can't wait until then, just click one of the other videos below. Bye!